all right so what is going on today youtube we're going back in with the shadaw shiri new jack or shiri ah, sh yeah shadaw shiri new jack um jesus christ it looks, sounds like i can't talk today but yeah we're going to go back in with this deck again uh i have not made any changes to the deck i believe no yeah i didn't i have not made any changes to the deck um so we're just going to hop straight into this um duel but what I did, uh, what's the name? I, I was told by, um, I believe, Billy Williams um, to grab Shadal Fusion instead of El Shadal unless I'm trying to OTK. So we do know that. Um, so yeah, that is it for the little prelude and let's hop straight into these duels. And before we start, I would like to say if you guys do enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, don't forget to also comment, let me know any changes you think I should make to this deck, anything that you guys wanna comment and stuff like that um leave it in the comment section below i don't have to tell you guys that a comment i'm pretty sure you guys have been on youtube for a minute um but yeah so <clears throat> also uh clicking that to help support the channel would be very appreciative so without further ado let's hop straight in and see if we can get some good duels all right now here we go against dark icarus silver and i believe i have played against this man before do not know what video i did though. i remember that i did though so it looks like we opened up pretty, uh, uh, it's an okay hand. Uh, Gozuki is pretty good. Um, the Needle Bug Nest is actually good. The Shadal Core is decent. So we can at least protect ourselves from two attacks or two destructions. Looks like we're going up against the DDDs. So that's not good. Is that a six scale? So you scaled some, you really, you had the damn Icarus. My, my bad, bro. You have a fucking terrible hand. It's, it, you know how bad a fucking DDD hand has to be if you're if, if you're if you're pendulum summoning Do you know like how bad that is as a hand you what do you have this? Okay, that's gonna get that correct, but you can only go into fiend monsters So I know there's no crystal wing dragon and stuff like that being plopped on the field So that is going to be all right with me. I'm not really tripping about that Um, He's probably gonna go into an eight but man, this hand has to be really bad. Like, I've never... The last time I seen uh, a DDD deck Pendulum Summon, I don't even know when. I can't even tell you. Does this lose scales? No, that's just... Um, then you can just add one back. That is just ridiculous. That's pretty good, I guess. So you can go into an 8. This is once per turn, correct? Um, it should be, hopefully. Yeah, so it's only once per turn. So pretty much what he can do... What did he search? Um... What the fuck is this? Okay, during your opponent's turn, if this card's in your hand, you can target two face up. Um, spell and trap cards you control. You cannot spell someone for the rest of the turn except fiends. Destroy the targeted, and if you do, spell someone in this card. Why would you? Okay, I guess you get rid of the um, the continuous spells. Um, this, okay, this is a uh, pretty bad. But you know what I can do? Is I can normal summon this sin, what's the name? Run into it and pop this. You know, I mean, pop this. Special summon, I guess, Mizuki or something. It's a, it's a, it's, this is this hand is not too good. Let's see, what does it say? Uh, hmm. I'm just going to pendulum summon again. So, with that being said, we got to at least get rid of this. So, we're just definitely going to do that. Probably going to special summon this in defense mode. And just end our turn like that because uh, yeah this is not the greatest hand um, let's go ahead and send this let's go ahead and ram we're gonna take 1100 but we're gonna be able to get rid of it so that's cool let's go ahead and pop and then we're gonna special some of this right in defense mode we're gonna use that to go ahead and pop the uh, Go ahead and pop the Sig uh, Sigfried because the reason why we're popping Sigfried because we do have two cards that we do want to, I mean, I try, guess try to survive with. Hopefully we don't die. And you know what I'm thinking? Uh, at, at, at the, yeah, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for the Needle Bugs Nest, but I'm not going to, um, what did I say? I don't even know what I was saying just now. I'm going to wait for the Needle Bugs Nest. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Before he tries to get like a sick free or something out that destroys spells and traps. I just don't want to shotgun it. Jesus Christ. He's gilling the house. Why is the is this this card must not be out yet? See so yeah, look at that. Is it effect negated? 
Because I don't even think it said that, did it? No, it's not. Jesus Christ. Okay. So he's gonna probably gonna target Siegfried. And then that's where we're going to chain um needle bugs and that's in Shadal Core. Um, what are you popping? Okay, well I guess we just chain this now. Shadal Falco, yes, sure. What else did we mill? Ooh, that's pretty good. We did not mill a Shadal card, so uh, this is going to be bad because he's going to pin them. Just one? Wow, that's pretty dumb. I don't understand why you only pin them something once. But I, I guess. I guess. I mean, there's nothing really wrong with it, I guess. You know what? All right, so he's getting that. Um... This does trigger, doesn't it? Okay, well, now we're going to just activate that right on in the defense mode. Because I don't want it to get negated. So he only can go into Fiend, so I know he can't go into Hope Galaxy or anything like that. And since we... Oh, we don't play Shogun Saga. I think that's what I was supposed to add to this deck. I think I was supposed to add Shogun Saga. Yes, I think I was. I was supposed to add Shogun Saga. Because... Um, yeah, I was supposed to add, yeah, that's exactly what the hell I was supposed to add. We have no outs to a rank eight. Um, except for Scarlight and Moonlight in Black Rose and Castell. But yeah, definitely was supposed to add what's the name. Uh, you can use both, what? He's probably going to banish my two star. Probably be the best thing for him. Yeah. Um. See, that's stupid. He just has two effects. He has like three effects. That's just retarded. That's just dumb. But he should get rid of my. Uh, if I'm not mistaken. No, he's not. He's probably not going to get rid of anything. Um. Shit. He got rid of that. That sucks. I don't believe we played burial either. He's probably going to attack my Falco. Yeah, he is. Okay, so that that really sucks. All right, so we're we're, we're not going to get a lot. We're not getting far, folks. This looks like this is one of them, one of them duels we just don't win. Actually, it may can win because what does it say? Its effect is negated. So that's that's not good. What we need is uh like a. There, that's exactly what the fuck we needed. That was actually a good card. Don't tell me you what what the fuck could you possibly have? That'll don't tell me that's a warning. I'm gonna be pissed. I'm gonna be pissed if that's a warning. A fucking scolding. Wow. That's that's the thing he came up with. He runs scolding in this deck. Why? Why, folks? Why does he run scolding? Please let me know. If you guys can let me know. Just just please let me know. Why does he run scolding? Oh, that sucks. That's the hurtfulest shit I've ever seen in my entire life. I always get I always get fleeced. I always get fleeced. Every time I play this deck, it's just, I mean, every time I play, I just get fleeced. And there's really nothing I can do about it. Um, If he's smart, he's probably going to negate it. And it, it should. No, wait, should it? I don't know. Because it should put it back to. um. It should. It, whoa. Yeah, I believe I lose here, folks. Because I believe he's going to pop this. Yeah, target one spell and trap card in the field and one other DD. Yeah, he, I think he's gonna pop and pop. But yeah, I, I just we just get hit by the most randomest shit. Like he opened up bad. Well, I don't know if it was bad because he is playing like a different deck. But he opened up not the greatest of hands. Not not the best we've ever seen. DD DDDs opened up, and still somehow miraculously, I'm still getting my shit pushed in because he runs scolding. Out of all cards, it's scolding. Like, damn, man. I, th I think this happened last time I played him. I think he was he played one just random card, and it ended up, I don't know. I, I, just, I, I really have to, I don't know. I really believe I played him before. I don't, I just don't know where. All right, yeah, this this game is over. Um, Actually, um, it, I do have a saving grace. Does it go back? Yeah, it does. So see, look, that's why I said this is completely over, right? Yeah, this is over. 
Um, yeah, I don't take half damage or anything like that. It's just over. I just can't. I can't beat stuff like scolding. Good for him, but God damn it, that that hurts. Oh yeah, I lost to a pot of riches. I don't know. What well, I lost to a fucking pot of riches. I I don't know what duel it was. I, that's what the fuck I lost to though. I lost to a damn pot of riches, which was a. That's the worst thing you can lose to, man. It's a damn pot, like really a pot of riches. Um, yeah, it it just I that's uh that that hurt me so much. A pot of damn riches. That's what I lost to. I remember now. I don't know if it was him, but it may have been. Him. Oh damn! Don't tell me we were playing against Mermels. Okay. Well, that's fine. All right. So let's see what we can do. Oh fuck! Ah. All right, looks like it's one of them days, folks. It is one of them damn days, folks. It's one of them days where we just, you just get your shit beat in, man. There's just nothing really we can do about it. You just get our shit beat in. We're just playing the most random decks with the best hands. I mean, Mermails always open up good. I've never, like every time I play Mermails, I I don't they've never opened up bad against me. Now to crack their board. It's not hard, but I'm just saying. What was that? Okay, Dragoons, I don't have anything for you, sir. Um, But the character board is not hard. Okay, that works for me. Because I do have two cards that do trigger. But uh, the, the boards are, are the easiest to crack. But it, the, the problem is, is that we fucking, uh, it, it just, they just open up the greatest hands. And you got to remove player frog. So I'm not tripping about that. I don't understand what he's trying to do here. Um, what the fuck? Um, oh, wait, what? But you cannot spell some monsters from your hand for the rest of the turn. Okay, so why would you do that? You can't summon Mullen Gracia, sir. You can't summon Mullen Gracia. You can't summon anything else now. All right. And on the summon, hit him with this. Whoop, whoop. Simple as that. Don't tell me you have a my body. Because I'm going to be very pissed off. Um, hmm. I don't have really anything in the graveyard. So, I guess we can get one of these two stars. And that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's seven. You can't summon Swap Frog. Can't do anything like that. So, that's cool. Um, hmm. We could normal summon this Shadal Falco. We could do a lot of stuff right now. That's pretty good. You know what? I don't think I'm summoning this Shadal Falco now. Um, we can go ahead and go. Oh, wow, Sully. Why, why would you surrender? Why would you surrender, man? Alrighty. I don't understand, understand why you surrender when you, you clearly didn't read the cards that you, you put in your own deck. And, oh, Jesus Christ, we're just not opening good no more. The first video, we just opened up pretty good. Oh, fuck, I hate this deck. Actually, I like it because they're going to add that trap card. And he's going to banish all my shit. And all my shit's going to trigger. So go, oh, damn. All right, so I learned my lesson last time. I, <laughs> I fucking let that card stay on the field and lost. I did learn my lesson last time. All right, what does it say? Oh, damn it, I don't know. And they don't tell you. They just don't, they don't, oh, they do tell you. All right, banish your opponent's time of your hand. Okay. All right, so he's going to activate it, and then he, I'm just going to start popping shit. Ooh, fuck, that hurt. That sucks. Yeah, this, this deck is ass, man. Fuck this goddamn deck. That's fine. Woo! Woo! Okay, now it's going to try to trigger like 15 times. Um, yeah, Solitaire, Spirit Master, and Smith. Uh, let's go ahead and do... Um, it doesn't matter. It's just not going to resolve, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I don't want it to get negated. So we're going to do one, two, and three. Um, we're going to special summon... What do I have in my hand? Sage, Dragon. I guess we get the Smith. Um, we're going to pop... Um, yeah, dark. I think dark woman nightmare because I yeah, I just don't want that to even resolve. He can't strike anything, so that's cool. Right in attack mode. Uh, 
yeah okay so let's go ahead and use Shadal Fusion and we're going to go into uh, what the fuck do we want to go into I kind of I don't want to go what's the name if I go Winda then it's gonna be a problem so let's go Grista by doing these two and then we can just go Shadal Dragon to pop that and then he's uh, going to I guess um, yeah alright so we're gonna just normal summon this and then we're gonna use you to get uh, you and then we're going to go ahead and attack because that's the best thing to do and I still haven't added Shogun Saga which I'm definitely going to do um, at the end of this game because that's a card that needs to be in here because that really helps everything out and it, 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 it really hurts when you don't have it but it's okay it is alright it stops special summons correct I think it does so let's go ahead and send uh, another um, young who we should send what's the name huh? uh, we should send a two star for next turn we should but I'm thinking Mizuki because I don't I mean I do want to activate that young uh, that young um, Icarus attack I'm going to search so that would be cool No need to chain. Let's go ahead and grab the Icarus attack. Then, so on my opponent's turn, uh, we can go ahead and just grab this because that's that's a cool card to activate. Um, we've already used two uh, Sage's effect once per turn, so we're not going to do it again. But during the draw phase, we're going to activate and we're going to banish it. then that's fine this is going to trigger and we're going to re we can put this right back in the graveyard because that's exactly where it needs to be we're going to use uh omega's effect to return the ooh, three triple sage is gone but you know what we can easily get that back at any point in time then we're going to use that so now our opponent is pretty much what what happens uh cannot be activated holy fuck hmm that 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 fucking sucked well you know what um we only play one of those so fuck like how did he hit it right while this card is faced up your opponent cannot cannot be activated until the end phase hmm you know what uh, I don't I don't think I should trip. No, I'm not going to trip. I don't think he can kill me, so it doesn't really matter. Um, this is probably going to just add a... What's the name? Probably going to add another one of the... Um, this card right there. Nope, it does not. This card is added to your hand. What happens? All right, I'm trying to read what it does. You can special summon it. When this card inflicts battle damage. Okay, attack directly. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. Um, yeah, I'm going to activate this and target um, you with double your defense. And the reason why I'm doing that is so he can't attack me. So that would be... Yeah, because if my opponent... what If my opponent declares an attack, yeah, they have to attack that. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah. Monsters my opponent controls cannot attack for the rest of the turn except to attack that monster. Oh, okay, all right. Didn't know that was happening. What does it say? Okay, so let's go ahead and um, activate this. Then we're going to change this Rise of the Four Heights, targeting my Omega. And so I believe that we have the game in the bag. I believe we do because he cannot he can't attack he should not be able to attack thank you there it goes and then during the end phase I'm gonna just activate this and destroy his whole board because that's what we can do with this deck and I believe that's going no we're gonna get one more duel and we're gonna to add to Shogun Saga so we can all just feel good 
What? Okay, what's supposed to happen at the end phase? Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to activate my targeted card. Whoop. I'm going to pop, pop. Then we're going to banish this. We're going to use this effect to pop this. Because we're cool like that. All right. And then we get back the young man known as Cyframe Lord Omega. And yeah, it's not really too much he can do. Let's go ahead and just. What is in here? Nope, we don't want to use this Mizuki. You just go ahead and summon this. All right, what's the highest defense in here? 12, 2,400. Okay, so with that being said, yeah, there's just no way. We, we, just, we can just win this duel right now. Because even if he does bring out something, we can activate Samurai to go ahead and pop. What are you targeting? Um, I, but this, this, this should work. Yeah, because this would be chain link two. This would be chain link two. That would be chain link one. Meaning that when this resolves, there would be a monster on the field to go ahead and pop. And. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Let's see. I'm just. What, what, what the fuck? You sack of shit. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to continue my battle. I'm going to kill you. We still win, doesn't really matter. Attack you, banish you. Um, we get that just out of the duel. And then we're going to, yeah, there we go. So, be right back. Going to switch, a, uh, put Shogun Saga in for Carrot Spark Dragon and be right back. All right, so I did make uh, two changes, actually. What I did was I took out the Clear Wing and I took out the Spark Dragon to, ooh, Lawn Mowing. There we go. So, we we, we, we added both Sure new. Don't tell me we're playing fucking Dracos. Oh, oh, oh my God. Player X, you're going to be so upset. Oh my God. Holy shit. He's going to be upset. He's going to be upset. I wonder if he knows the combo. So I added Sun Saga and I added Shogun Saga. I took out the Clear Wing and I took out the, um, I took out, uh, what is his name? Uh, fuck. Damn it. I, how did I forget the name? Um, he should, there should be a Sage coming from his hand, right? No, no, he didn't. Okay. Well, you know, there's a first for everything. So what was I about to say? I took out Clearwing and Spark Dragon for Sun Saga and Shogun Saga. Oh my God. Why would you do that? Player X, come on. Finally, we opened up Lawn Mowing and we're not playing against a 60 card deck and he quits in the first turn, which really just sucks. All right. So let's go ahead and activate this. And see what he calls. He's probably going to call one being conditioned. There we go. There we go. Oh, that hurts. Oh, he's upset. He's upset. I would be fucking majorly upset. Oh man, that that's just, that that pisses me off. Um. <laughs> okay, so what can I do here? Hmm. I could normal this to get that back. That doesn't do anything. You know what? I think I'm going to uh keep it do i want to keep it i don't know folks i think i kind of want to keep it let's go ahead and send um mizuki yeah let's keep it let's just keep it i mean i'm gonna give you a chance sir and you know what since uh ooh, i forgot we play that card huh oh let yeah we're, we're not gonna keep it i know exactly what we're gonna do here i'm gonna use you to do you so go ahead and do you. I forgot we played your dolls. I really did. So let's go ahead and go Minerva because that's just a fantastic card to go into. Free three mils. Um, let's go ahead and dump. We don't play snow, so I don't think it matters what we dump. Ooh, Squamata. Yay. Um, yes, I do want to check my graveyard. Come on, dog. Oh my God. You know what, man? We're gonna. I re... we're gonna try one more time, man. People are just quitting left and right. All right, so we're going up against player. Have we even won a die? I mean, rock paper scissors yet? And we, oh, we got cosmic flare now. That's that's pretty good. And we have drawn what we needed to draw. It's exactly what the fuck we needed to draw. Why you say? Is no, not actually that. Um, I was talking about uh, terraforming because a lot of decks, such as true Dracos and stuff like that, um. They're not true. Yeah, true Dracos. True Dracos, Dinos, a lot of decks require specific 
um, types. Like dinos, they need to be dinos, so Zombie World fucks that up. True Dracos, they can't tribute summon, so that just works for me. Um, let's go ahead and go Omega. Then, for the fuck of it, we're going to activate this terror. Not for the fuck of it, but that's obviously the best way to. He's probably going to quit because if he's playing any one of those decks I just mentioned, um, he will quit. But let's go ahead and activate this. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and activate that. And let's go ahead and send Squamata. And then Squamata can send Beast. No, not Beast. Um, is it Beast? That is Beast. Okay. So, hmm, do I want to send? Yeah, I want to get a draw. Let's get a free draw. See what we luck up into. A Unizami. All right, that's that's decent. I mean, can't complain. Let's go ahead and do that. And then with this, I, I, I want to set it just as a bluff. Nah, that's what we're going to do. So, like I said, if it's a true Drake, if it's true Dracos or stuff like Dinos and stuff like that, we pretty much locked them out of the door. Now, this is a good way to go into a what's the name magical mallet okay so it, it must be something important in your hand let's go ahead and hit it out the way and it's a pakaya and you're playing magical mallet in a paleo okay he's quitting because he cannot go into tree toad with this and if he does go into tree toad actually he can't go into tree just can't use the effect oh, okay so yeah stardust is definitely coming on the board immediately immediately stardust is coming on the board um there's no even oh god that was a good that was a good one that was a good one. So, let's do you. Let's grab. Let's grab you and the zombie. Let's see what we can do with that. Oh, that's that's a good card I can do. Let's see if he's gonna allow me. Ooh. Okay. So. That being said, we can use the card from hand. Let's target you. Cause I want to. You know what? I I want to go into what's the name. Wait, I can go Stardust. I don't I don't know what I'm tripping for. I can activate this on Stardust. Ooh, reasoning. Let's see what he hits. He's probably gonna call four. Um is he gonna call four? Call four, sir. Call it. There we go. Alright, there we go. Oh, that's a real good card. That's a real good card. That was a fucking real good card, Emil. Um yeah, let's send the Mizuki. Then what we, what we can do right here is we can go Stardust, right? We can go Stardust, correct? Activate this Cosmic Blair, put that shit right back into this deck. And then, um, if he's trying to destroy anything, uh, we can just go ahead and just, you know, use the card. I mean, banish it from the graveyard. So let's go ahead and add the Swallow Slash. Um, let's go ahead and put that into fence mode because I don't want to run into anything so let's go ahead and attack let's see if he has anything but I think we have to do this before um yeah so anything it battles just goes back into the deck so that'd be alright with him and uh yeah now so if he tries to destroy anything we can go ahead and just you know negate with basically we get two stardust negations Go ahead and put one of these up and i did not normal summon i, I should have set the hedgehog but i got so caught up with what i was just doing just now i completely forgot to normal summon and uh that could cost me because i could easily set this and why would you do that knowing i have i, I like i have an omega on the board like there's no reason to do that player there's no reason no reason at all is that only for this turn uh let's see if it's only for this turn um this turn oh yeah wait yeah so it's this turn let's go ahead and you oh jesus christ that it was ridiculous um hmm uh let's go ahead and normal summon this uh yeah let's just see how far we can take this uh let's go sage sage tribute this grab me a young man known as uh Grab me a, a young man known as a uh, Unizombie. We're going to get the two star here. What does Pakaya do? Um, e okay. I'm going to use this. And in real life, even if this card is not on the field, it still banishes the card. No, not. No, if, even if you book it. All right. What does this do? Can I be sure about battle? Um, okay. 
Not tripping about that, sir. Um, you can go ahead and have that. That's fine with me. Um, that gets vanished. That resolves without effect. We're going to special summon this right in defense mode. Then we're going to use Goblin Zombie to go ahead and search. Um, we're going to go ahead and search for a Zombie Master because that is a fantastic card to do. Then we're going to go ahead and go into... Ooh, we can go Shogun Saga by using these two. And then returning Stardust to the deck and popping a card. But you know what? We're not going to do that now. We're going to use Stardust Charge Warrior to go ahead and get us a draw. And then with that draw, we can go ahead and activate this young man known as... Uh, yeah, we can go ahead and activate that right now. Bam, bam. He can't really do anything anyway. He's, he's pinned down from Zombie Boy, so I don't think it matters. Um, I believe I should have what's the name in the graveyard, correct? So we're going to banish the samurai. The samurai is going to trigger. We're going to add back the sage. And then we're going to try to, I mean, attack for 25. And hopefully this man doesn't, doesn't top deck a card of demise. Because then he'll just get right back in the game. And we can't finish the game early. So. Oh, okay. Well, he's not the best Paleozoic player. Um, let's see how long have we been 30 minute territory this is what I was fearing I did not want to go into the 30 minute territory all right so we finished right there we're good thank you guys for watching sure do ah sure I knew Shadals um, and hold on let's go to the deck list one more time to just finish off the video. all right so like I said the only changes I made was put in Shogun Saga and so Sun Saga as, as our zombie synchro so yeah that is it for today thank you guys for watching see you guys tomorrow